Hi guys, welcome back with the Quarantine Chef. Today we're gonna cook the pineapple. So first of all, I'm gonna tell you the story of a pineapple. I bought this pineapple like maybe a week ago. And yeah, it, it looks was... like it. <laughs> no, it actually was green. It was beautiful and green. So I keep it like, a, you know, in a house for like, like six, six days and it become brown. And we decided to cook it today because it's time to eat it. Absolutely. So it's gonna be an easy recipe to make. So it's, um, let me show you first of all how to cut the pineapple. So in fact, the pineapple is a roasted pineapple. You just said we're gonna cook a pineapple. It's a roasted pineapple. Yes, it's gonna and be. And what are the ingredients inside? The ingredients are gonna be brown sugar, uh -huh. butter, a little bit of lemon, and that's it. Cool. That's it, because we're using what we have and we can add some alcohol, but we're gonna talk about it okay. after that, okay? First, we're gonna take care of the pineapple. Okay. So you need a bread knife. A bread knife. Bread knife. Oh, one with the ridges. See, that's easy, right? Yeah. Take this one like this, okay. right? Okay. So you cut the pineapple like this. Chop the head off. Chop the head off, yes. <laughs> and then... Oh yeah, see, it's a good color. See, it's beautiful, it's ready. It's the yeah. yellow one, I think. See? And then nicely, you, you be careful with the hand like this, and you move your knife like this. See that? Yeah. Can you uh, peel an apple in one go with a peeler? Because I think that's very sexy. Yeah, I can't, but this is not the case now. It's, I know, you can't. The, pi <laughs> the pineapple. This so skin's what? a little thick yeah. to shoot with a, yeah, to cut it with a um, peeler. Yeah, but I don't like those little hard edges. Are you going to make sure all those little parts get off? Okay, I'm just thinking, asking. They hurt, but you it's know. pretty big, so it's the way too big for both of us. Anyway. It is, but we can cut some up and put it on the side to make a little cold fruit salad. You don't have to use it all Correct. to roast it, right? Correct. That's what we're going to do. Okay. It's good in yogurt. I like pineapple yogurt. Right. All right. This part. That's pretty good. You got it all off in one piece. Come on, ladies all and gentlemen, right. look at that. Bravo, that? bravo, Ooh, bravo. Right See that? Yeah, excellent. All right. Okay. So we're gonna cut the bottom of it. Okay. Ta-da. Watch. Make sure it tickles. Yeah, those things here. hurt. You know? Because I'm sensitive. I know, but you know, Jack. Like, I'm making sure it's gonna be good though. See, this is the color of it, right? Yeah, it's beautiful. very, very beautiful color. And then what we're gonna do before we cut it, we're gonna study the, we're gonna study the, the caramel. Let me take out that after, right? Okay, okay, yes, sir. So we're gonna do the caramel. I'm following you. Brown sugar. Okay. Right. Oh, so, so the pan's not on yet, right? Nothing else, just the brown sugar. Okay, nothing else, just the brown sugar. Yes. But it's a the it's, on, it's, it's already hot. Oh, oh, so it's, okay. Is it on low? Is it on low? It's on low. See that? Okay, well, yeah, we couldn't see it, so now I understand. It. Okay. See the big... So, okay, got it. How much brown okay. sugar is that? Good question. Maybe like... Maybe a cup? No, maybe like six spoons. Okay. Like this. I'll measure afterward, right. everyone. <laughs> okay. So this is what I'm going to do now. Okay. I like that he cleans... Everyone, I like when he cleans as he goes. That is excellent. That's okay. the key. So I'm cutting the pineapple like this. Okay. Okay. And I'm gonna make some. Ah, interesting. I would have mm -hmm. automatically thought that he would do rondelles. Because the center, it's the center is good though. Because it's already ready to eat. See that? It's That's the part I like. Can I eat that? Sure. Thanks. All right, see that? Wow. So I'm kidding. These are the benefits of my job. Well, <laughs> yes. So let's keep those for us for later. Mm. Right? And we have like four pieces of, of pineapple, right? Mm-hmm. Okie dokie. Okie dokie. So. This is the best part. I really like this part, honey. So, this part. Yeah, it's, it's harder, but it's, the flavor is in, is in the middle, right? Uh -huh. That's why I like it. Okay, so what we're going to do now... Kind of like me. My flavor's in my middle. <laughs> so what we're going to do now... So I warm up the, the, this, the, the, this one already. So what I'm going to do... 
That's not on. Oh my it's God. It's on, right? Really low. Okay. 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 Nice day. So, I'm going to melt the butter. Maybe a little bit more butter. Watch out. Okay. That's something that is. So, be careful with the sugar. See, it's melting right now. Yes. So, let it melt. Okay. Nice. Okay. So what I did, I, I turned on the oven. Oh, at what, right? how many degrees? 400. Okay. I turned on the oven at 400, and then I'm waiting for the butter to be. Butter is interesting though. Sometimes if you have the plate, <clears throat> if you have the fire on too, it might burn if it's too high. So you have to be careful of that, don't you? Correct. Correct. Okay. Correct. <laughs> but see, it's oh, yeah. be beautiful though. So you gotta be careful. Just a little bit. Be careful with the sugar. Do not leave the taste. Yes. Yes. Yeah. with that because dangerous. Can you hear the sound? Oh, it smells so good. I love the smell of the brown sugar melting. Yeah. Okay. So now, when the bottle is like this, then you add the pineapple. Like this. One, two. Now this is a really cool um, thing to make a dessert. If, um, if you want to call it dessert, but um, you can put it on top of ice cream. You could have uh, Madagascar vanilla. Tell me all cook. the different things that you yeah, can you do. Yeah, you can, you can, you can, you can do the flambe with the rum and oh, vanilla. Oh, we don't have any rum. You can no, we don't drink in this house, so we don't have any rum. I drink but, occasionally, but, but I don't can, like rum. You can uh, <laughs> add the vanilla. And you can put some vanilla base inside. Oh, um, okay. While you're roasting it? Yes. Look at that. See that? It's beautiful though, right? Yeah, it's turning a cool color. And it smells really good. Yes, almost ready. Right. So, because because the uh, the pineapple is already, it's already uh, really good. It's very so ripe. I don't have to I don't have to add any sugar on it. Oh. Yeah. But if it, was, if it wasn't just right, would you have to add a little bit more sugar? Yes. But, okay. uh, otherwise, the recipe won't be the same anyway. Okay. So, okay. All right. So what's that? What are we going to do now? Because that was on a lower heat. The brown sugar is on a lower heat. And now that's on a higher heat in the back. Okay, got it. And what I'm going to do... Oh, okay. Like on the caramel like this. Right. So that's why I said be careful with the kids because it could be dangerous. Yeah. Very, right. it could be very dangerous. Could be very dangerous. And it's really, really, really hot. Right. Watch now. Finish See? So you just brown it ever so lightly. Yes. And then, see, it's starting to be a beautiful brown color. Yeah. See that? Because so many people just, we don't know, they don't know how to, to cook, to work with the pineapple. Well, I don't think it's a, a, a dessert that we think about doing um, in America. And it's really cheap. When we do, when we do, um, Fruit, we usually just do fruit, you know what I mean? We just do fruit as it is in California. Can you pull anyway. it a bit? It looks beautiful. Watch what I'm doing. Oh. See that? Yes. Ooh. See oh, the you sort of like baste the, the soap brown sugar? Can you oh, it come on. Like this. See that? Smells so good, too. So that's why you, you have to be careful. Take a big fork like, yeah. like this one and, you know, be really careful with it. Okay? Okay. See that? And I put it right there. I'll be your assistant and turn off this flame. Please do. So be careful oh. with that. And you're going to keep it, the oven on for 400? In the oven. For how many minutes will it be there? Say two, three minutes. Can you turn your light on in your oven? I want to peek in yes. that window. Two, three minutes. It's in there. And in the meantime, we can we can talk about the recipe again. Okay. So, so how much? Let's talk about the ingredients first of all. Ingredients: lemon at the end. Okay. Uh, brown sugar. Uh, pineapple, of course. Mm -hmm. Butter. Okay. And basically, that's it. 
Cool. And you can add vanilla, you can add rum, you can add uh, Jack Daniels if you wanted to. Where would you put the alcohol in? Would you put at it the in what, at, oh, at, at the, the very end. end. At okay. The end. Are we using the actual lemon or are we using the zest of the lemon? No, we're using the lemon juice. The juice. So I'm going to show you how to do that. Yes, sir. So, oui, chef. They're good, though. So three, 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 four minutes to cook, five minutes, not even. Okay. Um, what else? Any questions, Elizabeth? Um, I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think. Uh, very impressed with the way you pulled off that pineapple with one slice. Okay. Love that. Um, so you, yeah, it can just be served obviously just as this, or you could, you know, put it on top of a sponge cake. Perhaps give us some other ideas of what we can do with this dessert. Eat it just as it is, or put it with what? Uh, you can say with uh, coconut ice cream. Could be. Oh, <gasps> ooh, and make it tropical. You can shave. You can shave some uh, lime zest on the top of it. Instead of using a lemon juice, you can use lime. What would the difference be between the lemon juice and the, what, what? The flavor what, is going to be different. Okay, but explain to me what. The what, flavor is going to be more exotic. Okay. With the lime, you know. Okay. Because we're talking about an exotic recipe. The good thing about the about the, the pineapple, they're not expensive. So I, you know how much I pay for this one? I pay two dollars for it. Okay. So for the big one. So this is something. That's you guys a good can idea. Do, right. See the beautiful dog. Huh? Looking good. Looking um, good. What else do you want to know? I don't know. I can't think of it. I, I think that you should start telling people. Perhaps they should send you ideas of things. They have a you know ideas for for what they want to see you cook. I think we should be open for that. What do you? How do you feel about that? Yes. Yeah. Please send me some ideas about what you guys want me to cook. Uh, we are planning on cooking the pie risotto really really soon. And, uh, and as soon as I get some strawberries either from my garden or at the store, you're going to make me a strawberry tart. That's right, because... Uh, I want a real uh, authentic French strawberry tart, tart of fraise. <laughs> because at the beginning of the season here, the very, very good one, uh, the very, very good strawberries from California. And we're going to do a nice strawberry tart uh, for you guys and for us, more for, for us than you guys. <laughs> but we, you know, we love to share with you anyway. Of course. Well, so watch out. That's beautiful. beautiful. I mean, you could probably keep them roasting for a lot more, longer, Jill. Is that little correct? Little but little. I think just for everybody, they have the idea now, and you can put it in the oven, let it cook some more. But I think that that's, that's basically the recipe. You put it back in for a couple, five more minutes. Five we more won't minutes. make people sit and wait with us. Yes. But we love everybody. We're happy that they came to visit us today to say hi and that we can say hi and thank you for letting us in your home. And go ahead, chef. And uh, please uh, stay home and save and uh, we'll see you next time. Hey, by the way, can I say, I love your shirt. Oh, thank and you. And I know that's, that that's one is, peak. yeah, that? slash a snake pit. See that? What does it say on the other hand, on the mm -hmm. other arm? It says, ain't life grand. Ain't life grand. Well, it's grand with you. That's an old t-shirt from uh, from Stasha gave it to me a long time. It's ago. a good one. Let me look. I'm closing up on that face. Oh yeah, that's pretty excellent. Well, I love you, Jill. Um, everybody out there, we love you. Stay home, stay safe. Okay, love each guys. other. Bye. Be, See you be next time. Be kind to one each other. See you next okay. time. All right. Bye, guys. Bye. Bye.